are you a nail tech and you just totally lost your inspiration you have no clue what to do when it comes to nail art or are you just interested in getting into art but you don't know really where to start and you need a little kick to help you get going this is my top tip for any of you who needs a little bit of extra help to get your inspiration going and especially for nail techs switch mediums that's the best way to challenge your brain and start thinking in different ways so i want to tell you about something that i found just recently so please stay tuned and i'm gonna tell you all about it trust me you do not want to miss this What's up guys welcome back to another video here on my channel today i have something completely different to show you and it's another art video Woohoo! so here i have a box it is called the scrawler box hopefully i pronounced that right it is a subscription art box with art supplies i've seen a bunch of these boxes around you know social media and they look so much fun and I think this is a great way to kind of, you know, just get your um, inspiration going. I sent them a message and I asked them if they would be interested uh, in me, you know, reviewing this, testing this out. And they were kind enough to send me this box and also they were very kind enough to give me a code so that you can get your scroller box a little bit cheaper so that is awesome as well you have the code and all that in the description box so you should definitely go check that out so let's uh, just dig into this one right away so in here we have okay this has been traveling long way well it's it's actually from the uk from uk to sweden so it's you know things have been moving around but in here we have a scroller box sticker we have a little description of what's in here so we're gonna check that out and also on the other side right here we have the scroller challenge so the word for this theme or this box is space mask so that's gonna be awesome i'm gonna try that out for sure okay so in here we have candy! Okay, Haribo is like my favorite brand of candy ever. I love Haribo, Haribo, whatever you want to pronounce it. These pacifiers, these are my absolute favorites. I've been obsessed with them since I was a little kid. So, you know, I'm very happy that I got some more of that, of course. Ooh, and let's see. Okay, so in here, I see three pens right away. And they are, because you can see that little uh, water brush mark, so they are water color pencils which is pretty cool i i've tried it out a long time ago but i haven't done it since so this is gonna be awesome so this is in the brand ko i noor i don't know how to pronounce that but they look really nice it's a black one a purple one and a blue one really looking forward to try these out and then we have a watercolor brush i guess because it looks like the theme is kind of watercolor so it is a number two very small and pointy and then we have another one very pretty it is a number 12 Oh, that's beautiful. I think these are synthetic. We'll find that out on the little piece of paper in just a second. And here we have, oh, this is interesting. It's a correct express pen. Super quick and even drying. Okay, fine point metal tip. Sounds very, very exciting. Woohoo, watercolors. I love watercolor. So these are some Van Gogh watercolors. I've not tried, uh, tried this brand out, so it's gonna be interesting to do that. And we have cerulean blue, lemon yellow, and Prussian blue. Perfect colors for galaxy. So in here we have a little bit of artwork. So it's inspired by this theme, obviously. That looks really, really pretty. I like that picture a lot. And the featured artist is Tillit. Then they have a little description of this artist and where to find this person on 
this person's social, social medias. Cool, she's from Germany. Wow, this is really pretty. And then we have two pieces of water color paper and they look really nice a little bit structured which i like so yeah that was about it let's read from this little thing right here so first off we have the watercolor paints van gogh watercolors are brilliant intense and very transparent they sound like they are very good to use and then we have the um correct express pen use it to correct any mistakes or to quickly add bold highlights to your work so i guess that's what we're going to use to add like little stars and stuff like that and then we have the ko Ainur mondelez watercolor pencil well i was right in the fact that it, it is a watercolor pencil these watercolor pencils have a high concentration of pigment blah 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 and yeah perfect aquarelle aquarelle technique and blah 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 it only needs a few drops of water sounds perfect then we have the uh brushes yeah synthetic hair brush and ideal for both light and heavy paints they have included two sizes size two for small details and size 12 for large color filling strokes and yeah and then they have the watercolor paper so it's a bocking for the watercolor paper 190 grams per square meter and it's a beautiful english watercolor paper okay cool i'm excited to try this out let's just do um, a speed painting with this and uh, see what we can come up with <laughs> 